Hello, my name is Paula Lacobara, and I am here because I really want to share something that's coming from my heart today, and I just couldn't stop it. I've been approached for the last few months uh, by women, you know, talking about money, wealth, femininity, business, and you know, I had the pleasure to talk to them, and also, I what I realized is that I can feel the fear that it's taking over, has been taking over women in business, and the fear, this fear about money, it's something that that it's really stopping women from actually uh, receiving what they desire, not only in their business but in their lives, and so in their business is stopping them from really receiving the money. So because they're scared, because because it's like you're shrunk. You know, you shrunk when you when you're scared, when you're in fear, and 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 then you're not allowing yourself to to really receive. You're not open. And now that I'm teaching a course about receiving, more and more the women in the course are realizing the importance of being open and to really not being afraid. And so. You know, it really, it really pains me because I, you know, the reason why I made almost three hundred thousand dollars last year in my business is because I wasn't afraid to invest on myself. First of all, I wasn't afraid of money, and second of all, I wasn't, I wasn't afraid of investing on myself. I know that when a woman is connected with her desires, and when she knows, like investing in yourself, it is the same thing as investing in your business, and it is essential for a woman entrepreneur to be successful. Successful, you require to invest. I mean, it's fun to get all the freebie stuff, and and you know, and I've done it too. But at some point, when you allow yourself to invest, you're saying yes to the universe. You're saying yes to receiving most of all. And so, you know, I'm talking to you with passion today because I really want to make sure that that you hear me. That understanding that investing in your business is one of the best things that you can do. No not only for your business, for yourself, you're investing in yourself, you're saying yes to yourself, you're telling the universe that you're worthy, that you deserve it, and, and things will come to you. Now, if you hear it from your head, it will probably won't happen. You have to allow your heart to also take over. You have to, you, you have to allow, um, allow the energy of receiving to take over and understand. And I know that this might not be the exact language that you hear most commonly, but because I I work with you know feminine the feminine empowerment in women in business. I understand that when a woman really allows herself to connect with her true nature, with her femininity in her business, she's able to call in every desire of your heart. So Today, I really want to encourage you to highly consider and really connect. First of all, tap in with your desires. Second of all, don't be afraid of investing and don't be afraid of money. Money is an energy and it would only come in if you are not afraid of it, if you're really open to it and knowing that when you do so, you will generate this energy for for it for the money to come to you to you will be in, in the receiving mode calling it in all right so I hope that this is useful, this is helpful for you, uh, and that you apply it. Really, you know, journal about this. Consider, consider yourself being in this place of power and femininity and connected and aligned with who you are because it is from that place that things open up in your path, in your business, and in your life. I hope you enjoy this video. And please, you know, leave me a comment below and let me know how, how do you experience money in your life? How connected you feel how disconnected you feel and what you know what are you going to do to transform this story for yourself I'll talk to you next week bye bye